Hey y'all, happy Easter. It is currently 11.32 and I'm with my roommate Tiffany. Mm -hmm. We're just gonna have a really nice day because it is sunny and 75 out and we're gonna go to Winter Park. Yes. And she's never tried Briar Patch so we might check that out but it's probably gonna be, well it's 100% gonna be <laughs> busy yeah, as for sure. poop. So we might go ahead and go to Boca which is a very also good option. To I also to. have stuff for my wine cart. Do you have credits left still? Yes. Me too. Maybe I should go get it because I don't. Go I don't, get I don't, it. Okay. Yeah. I need to go get it. Okay. Where is it? Damn it. Okay. I'm gonna. Yeah. BRB. So we just made it to Winter Park. We're gonna find Boca yeah, I'm and. So hungry. It's literally so crazy because whenever I usually come to Winter Park, it's on a Saturday, which there's the farmer's market here. You can never find parking here, but it's on a Sunday when the Lake Eola farmer's market is going on, so now there's parking. But I still thought it would be kind of crazy because like Easter, like Easter, you would think like yeah. people come to Winter Park after church, but yeah. whatever. We have our first question. Yes. <laughs> Are there any cute boys at UCF? I know this sounds <laughs> dumb, but I'm worried that there are no cute guys. <laughs> Tiffany can answer this because what she's she's mo more recently single than me. Well, oh, yeah. now she's not, but yeah. I have a boyfriend. Yeah. So Jake, if you're watching this, <laughs> um, I think so. I think if you're coming from out of state, I UCF think... boys are very different yes, from very other different boys because I'm used to like southern boys. UCF boys are like this like South Florida, Miami, like, yeah. okay, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, that's a good way to describe it because I feel like a lot of guys that are in fraternities and that come to UCF yeah. are all from majority, not all, but majority yeah, yeah, yeah. are from South Florida. Yeah. Um, no, they they're definitely- They're just different. They're just different. Yeah. They, they have, they're, I think there's more pretty boys, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, you know, if, if I think you're they're into more that. clean cut. <laughs> yeah. But then that's just like, as a general, like they're still like, you know, Southern S looking boys. Right. And I think like, the boys will vary from like fraternity to yes, fraternity. I was just gonna I say that. I think that's like yeah. very true. Like, yeah. I think um, they are really all different types of guys and they yeah. all really like kind of find each other. In their like for example, there could be like one fraternity that's more um, like country. Country Like, you know, or and then there's kind another. Of southern, or there's your like workout juice head guys. Yes, there yes. really <laughs> is like a variety. It was like for the two. I think the two that, I could do a way to describe it. There really is a variety for yes, everybody. Yes, agreed. Yeah. And I really think that there's also a lot of cute boys that aren't in fraternities yeah. that I think is like important. Yeah. But they're just kind of harder to find. Yeah. If you're not, you know. Yeah, because like, it's harder to meet them, obviously, yeah. if you're not like. But like, of, I think yeah. like for my four years, like just being in like random classes and stuff, like uh, like I'll come home and I'll be like, oh, like there's like one really cute boy, <laughs> you know, and he yeah, was yeah, in yeah. a fraternity yeah. or anything like that. So True. Yeah. it's just stuff like that, I think. Like I want these for my home. It's so adorable. What'd you get? Just finished up brunch at Boca and it was so good. so good. Made my tummy happy and the drinks we got were really good. Like usually I don't like alcohol just because it's like not, it doesn't taste good to me, but it didn't even taste like alcohol. It was so good. It was delicious. So our next question. Do you think joining a sorority helped you get involved at UCF and meet more people? And what are the advantages to joining a sorority? I've talked about this many times before, but um, I feel like joining KD kind of like helped put my passions out there for videography and photography and then mm -hmm. that got me noticed from by UCF which got me an internship at UCF and it just kind of was yeah. like a domino effect of like all these connections that I've made. So. No, I agree. Like for me, um, I'm a business major compared mm -hmm. to Sonali so a lot of times like it's really hard to get opportunities within business uh, all depending on who you know. So right. it was really helpful to like whether you knew like parents of sisters or right, right, you know right. just like it just really helps like getting you to understand like who to talk to and like network and mm -hmm. I think like we were literally talking about this the other day that we feel like K 
kids now, like you go to a lot of times people don't realize that you're going to college for school and for like to get a job at the end of the day, but mm -hmm. like nowadays it's to have fun. Yeah. And like, yes, of course, it's like important to have fun, but yeah. we see it all the time that like kids are going to college and like they're not getting prepared for like a real world. And right. it's like they try a little bit almost too late. And yeah. it's like yeah. they didn't try at all, but I think being in a sorority or fraternity like kind of automatically it. like kind of makes that yeah. step forward. What are the advantages? Networking is a big one and you hear it all the time. Just because like, I feel like whenever I get into the workforce mm -hmm. and I find out someone's a KD, we have an instant bond. Yeah. Like it's kind of weird to describe it, but it's just yeah. like, oh, you were a KD, like where were you a KD? And then yeah. like, you know, you kind of had this Something bond. to talk about. Something to talk about. So th that's like a cool thing. I think another advantage is like, at least for me, like it got me out of my like comfort zone. Mm -hmm. Like when I, f when we both first came into college, we both came in with like, yeah. boyfriends yeah. and they both were out of state yeah. so like I feel like for me it was like getting myself out there to like go to socials or mm -hmm. go to like um, you know social functions right. and like try to do things other than like sit at home and yeah. worry about what my boyfriend's doing yeah I mean there's so many advantages of being in a sorority mm -hmm. I actually made a video about pros and cons about being in a sorority so I will link that in the description box and I have a whole playlist about Greek life and sorority life so I'll link that down below as well. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go take some pictures around Warner Park, um, and there's this really cute, just, there's just so many cute places here to take pictures, honestly, so we're gonna find a spot. Um, the next question is, did you guys know each other before you came, became roommates? And yes. yes, we did. We went through recruitment together. I also, I like, remember seeing Sonali's during recruitment is because line. yeah because I, and it was in front of Katie I swear to god really because I remember it was um philanthropy day and that day they lined us up right in the front of the house mm -hmm. and I remember seeing her like right behind me because our line or our last names both start with P's yeah so like we were like near each other like the entire time yeah so yeah yeah I remember you but I feel like I didn't I feel like my first memory of you was in um lip sync we had like a dance competition that the new members participated in, and that's when I like kind of started to get to know you. Mm -hmm. But yeah, um, and we sit we sit next to each other in chapter. In chapter, yeah. And then so, yeah, yeah. So we lived together, and we served and on we, council for her. Yeah, like, yeah. So we served both served on council for two years. I did the same position, vice president of public relations, and then I was vice president of operations, and then um, the I was president, president next year. <laughs> So yeah, we live in the president's suite, and I also have a whole vlog about like our room, a mm -hmm. room tour of the president's suite at Capital to UCF. Mm -hmm. So cool. Um, but actually, our room's pretty freaking cute. So yeah. if you want to go see it, I think we're, we link down below. Best room. Oh yeah, no, like, yeah. People tell us that though. Yeah, yeah. It's very like Joanna Gaines. It's a uh, Old Town Road vibe. <laughs> old Town Road vibe. Do you ever get tired of seeing each other in the same room? No. No. <laughs> Cause I feel like I'm I'm pretty busy during the day, so like Same. it's nice to come home to someone and like like t talk. Do, we have very like sense? our schedules like kind of go well together. Like by the time like we're both done with our day, like if I'm done with class and she's done with like her internship stuff, mm -hmm. like we literally both get home around the same time. Yeah, and then we're just like kind of like catching up. Like we literally like take naps together. Yeah, <laughs> but like we don't really get sick of each other because I feel like we don't see we each like other that much that much and we also really like our alone time in the yeah. sense we're like we'll literally be in the same room but, but like, like turn over watching our own we Netflix. have like our own shows on and like yeah. it, that's like completely normal for yeah. us all right so right now we're actually gonna go look at winter park houses mm -hmm. because they're beautiful <laughs> yeah. they're like stunning we just want ideas of what we want, yes. want in the future yes they're all just so unique and beautiful so we're gonna go um i put my maps as craft azalea park so if this is one of your houses don't be weirded out yeah <laughs> you probably have a really nice house yeah oh that looks pretty this one oh where are these bushes i know why do they need their privacy <laughs> yeah <laughs> This looks like a cottage. <gasps> look at like that a cute one cottage. That's pretty. Oh wait, look at this one. This is oh, that so one's grand. really pretty. <gasps> I love this one. That's it's great. antique. -y. Yeah. So it's cool. for sale. Should I get it? Let's buy it. Let's buy it together. <laughs> Ooh, that one's pretty. Yeah. I like the terracotta look sometimes. Oh, this is an open lot. Yeah. This one's cute. It's cute. It's cute. It's like, it's like the um, what's it called? This looks like something oh, you'd see in so Beverly. Cool. This one's cute. Yeah. 
That doesn't even look like a house. Oh, oh my god. Garage. It looks like oh like a yeah. celebrity lives here. Yeah. You know? Perfect. This one's I think this one's cute. I think it might be cute. Oh, oh yeah, this so one's beautiful. Pretty. This one's beautiful. Oh back up, back up. That's so pretty. So pretty. What's this bad boy? Not my style, but so cool. cute. Like yeah, I love that. Cool. Yeah. That looks like a Grand Floridian or something, like a yeah. Florida home. Okay. Oh my God! Okay. Look at the Range Rover. Look okay. at those windows. <laughs> Look at those. Oh, this oh, is me. My God, this yeah. is me. Oh my God! The big wooden door. Oh my God! It looks like a oh, mm, a mini chateau. Yeah. This, this one. one. This is one is it. This is the one. This is the this, one. This is the one that you're talking yes, about. This is the one. Oh my god. Take a sure. picture of it so you know. This one's like bachelor mansion vibes, a hundred percent. Oh, this looks like. Oh my god. Doesn't it? Literally. It's oh my gosh, good. I love that because it's Mediterranean. Oh. So we just got home. We're back at Katie, as you can tell, our green oh. home. <laughs> nap time. Yeah, seriously, nap time. My eyes were getting so heavy on the way home. We saw the beautiful homes of Winter Park, and they were stunning. Makes me want to move into a home even sooner, <laughs> but really? got to get that money first, so we'll see about that. But we're closing out today's vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Follow Tiffany on Instagram. Follow me on Hell Instagram. Yeah. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.